Hi folks, welcome to Blackbeard's Detail on YouTube channel. I'm Ross, that's Josh, and on this vlog, as you've seen, we've got this Ducati Multistrada V4 Pikes Peak. That's a bit of a mouthful, so from now on I'll probably just call it the Ducati. Uh, we've got a Range Rover, which is due to go away, but if you're watching a vlog on a bike, you're probably not interested in that. Blah. So, uh, this has all got decon, we done it all yesterday, the condition of it is pretty decent. It's uh, brand new, fresh out the wrapper. So we can focus on just getting the jaw dropping gloss that we want to get from this paint. Uh, Remove a couple of stickers there that the uh, owner was requested to do. And the uh, rest of the day, we're just basically going to focus on getting the, the polishing work done. We've got some hand polishing work that we'll need to do uh, lower down on the bike. Well, when I say we, uh, Josh, we'll be lying down the ground doing that. And I'll be standing up and polishing the, the higher up bits. And uh, yeah, we'll see if we can get the first base coat done today on it. Uh, it's getting two base coats put on it and uh, then the top coat. So this thing should be mega glossy and mega protected for absolutely years to come. Uh, just a single application of the base coat should last anywhere between three and five years. We're putting two base coats on it uh, and then the top coat. So this thing going to be mega protected. The customer is probably looking to use it pretty much year round. So we want to make sure that it's well protected from the elements. So we're going to get cracked on with the polishing. See you shortly. Folks, well that's the polishing all finished on the Ducati. It's a beautiful soft paint on it and it looks mega glossy. So we've also put on these for the customer. We uh, need to get them on prior to coating. Because we put the coatings on it, chances are uh, they're not going to stick to it. So they've all been uh, put on, all matched up and they're to protect the, the tank and really grippy. So, give some good thigh grippage. So, uh, we're going to go ahead, give it the pre coat and wipe down, and then grab a wee coffee, and then we'll get started with the coatings. So it's the Friday uh, morning, just going into the afternoon, and that's the second base coat being put on this Ducati. And it's looking super glossy. The finish on it is absolutely unbelievable. The paint's just really lustrous looking. So uh, we've got a, a good bit of weight for the cure to go, or sorry, for the, the second base coat to cure, and then get the top coat on it. Uh, but it's just looking absolutely epic. Everything all protected, all plastics uh, down in there, the engine casing, uh, the exhaust, all that. As you can see, it's all super glossy. Even the, the centre kickstand is all done. So, uh, gonna, uh, Josh has just set up the road because there's no point in kicking about for hours waiting for a uh, that to get done. So I'll just mull about uh, and then get the the top coat put on it. But yeah, it's looking absolutely epic. It's just a mean looking thing, like from the the front all the way along. I'm just waiting for the obviously the the frame 
uh, to be cured as well before I put the seats back on it. But yeah, good work being done on this. It's uh, going to be protected for like years to come. There's two right good thick base coats being put on. So uh, pretty much the same as what I done on my bike. A customer had seen the vlog I had done on mine, which was over there, and uh, basically asked for the same same treatment. It's kind of overkill putting the two the two base coats on, but that should last years and years and years, especially if the customer is going to be using the bike uh, pretty regularly, especially over the kind of kind of grimy autumn uh, autumn months. So yeah, it should make for much easier cleaning and. Yeah, this thing just looks awesome. So, get the seats put back on once that's cured and get the beauty shots done. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please remember to hit that subscribe and smash the bell button so you get a notification whenever I drop a new video. Enjoy the beauty shots. See you later.